Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Valerie Dyson and today I'm going to share with you my Amazon finds. This is a first video of me doing Amazon finds. I have ordered from Amazon before but it was like one or two pieces and it wasn't like I never wanted to share it but I have been watching those videos like crazy here lately. A bunch of different people um, and I forgot exactly uh, I think it was like one or two people's videos that inspired me to do this video and I don't really remember their channel but yeah so I can't really give credit to where it's at because I really did go back to try to find the video and I've watched it so much I don't even know like I've watched so many people so many times I don't even know who it was anymore um, but anyways, woo. uh, okay, I guess I'll just, uh, show you the items and, uh, kind of put a picture of the item, like, if you was to see it from Amazon and link them down below, just in case you're interested, you can check them out. Um, I don't think, I think Amazon, you can't do affiliate links with Amazon. I think you have to have, like, Amazon affiliate links or something. So I might check that out. I don't really know yet if they're Anyway, uh, but yeah, let's get into seeing what I found and Share my thoughts and opinions about them. Okay. So this is the first item is a over-the-door um, Hanger and I really like it. I really ain't using it to be honest. I thought I would throw some purses or I don't know jackets of some sort on there but I have not done nothing with it yet so it's just hanging there but so far so good I mean they're they're not broken <laughs> came coming in um and there is how much shows on the other side let's see if I can show you a little bit more so, they're screw-on backs, just to let you know. They're not welded together. So, I figured I'd share those few thoughts because I did look up um, the worst, or one of the bad reviews on this, and it was that it um, came broken, um, and that um, they was disappointed in seeing that they're screwed on the back and not welded together, but... I like it. All right, this is a ocean wave projector. Um, so this is what it looks like, and it can't comes with this remote, like I was telling you earlier. Sorry about the mess again. You know, life, kids, whatever. Um, but yeah, this is the ocean wave projector. It comes with a little remote. And that's how you turn it on. And it shines on the ceiling. Which, this is not the best time to be showing you this. But, this is when I'm recording. So, but it is absolutely beautiful. Not only that, you got options to press. This changes the colors on this button. And this one, what does that do? I think that changes the speed on the thing which you're not going to be able to tell right now because or maybe no that's the the brightness that's what it is it's the brightness on this button and this button what does that do again like that oh and that is like it pauses it or plays it. So, you see, you can tell a little bit. That's what it looks like on the ceiling, but really in more detail. See, I paused it. There. That's what that button does. And then, see, I think it, this is for the sounds. Which one? Maybe it's 
all the way again. Okay. Oh shit, there's the sound. Okay, that's how you play the sound. There's the volume button. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay. And then you can change the sounds. I'm still learning. I can't hear it now. There it goes. That's my favorite one. And let's see. I mean, the volume, you know now. And what was that again? I think it was to turn it on and off. Like, no? I don't remember. Is that a timer? Oh, it's a timer. And then you can have one hour, two hour, or four hour, or just don't press anything and it just works. The only complaint, uh, or one of the major complaints that I saw about this item, and I can say would be a problem, which is no big deal to me, is that um, you see the little, little thing right there. That has to be pointed, the remote has to point to that. So when you're laying down on the bed, you can't just be like pressing the button. You have to like raise up and push the button and make sure it's not blocked by something. Um, yeah, it has to be pointed towards it. So you can't just have it turned away like this and point at it either. I don't think, hold on, let's see. Let's pause it. Oh, well, me. I don't know. Okay, so you can do it. It just has to be pretty gl close, I guess. So, just see how far you need from it. Which this reaches to my bed. I just have to sit up and kind of do it. Um, I have a king size bed though, so. But that's yeah, I'm really happy with this purchase too. So I recommend it. I'm thinking about buying another one, seriously, for the girls' rooms. Okay, again, excuse the mess, but this is a little bedside caddy that I purchased and forgot the price again. But, yeah, you can just put, I like to put tan and lotion because I got like to give Michael massages. And I... <laughs> uh, um, I like this because... Uh, I would keep this here because I know I can find it to pop a kid or something. <laughs> I don't know. I got castor oil in here. What else do I got in here? I got the remote to an uh, item you're going to see later in here. And let's see. I did have more stuff in there, but I already took it out and uh, threw it threw it around but i did look up and the re reviews and the worst review i can find it's rated really good but the worst review i could find was saying that it was made out of felt which i don't know what felt is but it's fine with me i wasn't expecting it to be like super sturdy or anything it's just a thing that instead of a trash bag i mean or something or only your counter i don't know um, they said something about it made out of felt and that it was flimsy, which, I mean, I don't know. I wasn't expecting it to be, like, really stiff. And that it kept falling. Um, okay, so what you do is put it under your bed. I don't, I don't know if they got a different one from me, but it goes pretty, pretty far back there, see? Shoot, I can't lift it. Milo's on top of here. But anyways, it goes in pretty good. And mine doesn't go anywhere. I mean, I don't know how. Maybe their their mattress ain't as uh, heavy as mine or what. But mine does fine. I love mine. I'm, I'm definitely happy with this purchase. Y'all excuse my house. I... Yeah, let's just say this is a lived-in house. Anyway, this is the digital alarm clock that I bought from Amazon. I forgot the price, but I will say I really love it. It's like a wooden type of look to it. And, um, 
it it's really cool because like you you can set three alarms on this clock and it also tells you like the humidity humidity um and the degrees outside with the time and it's kind of bright so i like how it um you know goes off like that and when i make noise it comes back on so in the middle of the night when it's pointed towards you it um you know it cut off on its own and if you make noise like say you don't want to raise up and press a button um you can just make a clapping noise or it, a clap noise wakes it up anyways but yeah it's a pretty good clock um i have it plugged up and um i did look at a review of a negative comment and all all i really saw that it was um i've had this okay so these this all of these reviews for these amazon purchases they all came together and i tried them out all on the same day and i have at least two weeks more more than two weeks worth of um wear or you know to v review these products and they said the third week of this clock the numbers started going out um but so far mine is not i really like it okay so this is the moon backdrop that i bought i'm trying to get all of it there you go um i have I'm going to have all the links in, with the prices and the measurements in my description box below. Um, just in case you're wondering any of that. Um, but yeah, so I love this thing. I shouldn't put my finger in the way. It's trying to unfocus. But um, it's really big. It is simple. Um, and it's easy to hang with some tacks. It came with some kind of tacks or something, but I didn't know how to make them work. So I just used regular thumbtacks and put them on each corner. Um, but yeah, that's what it looks like. The one I picked, they do have a lot of other colors. And from what I can tell, this one doesn't really have any complaints on the website about this one. Um, there is like a red and green one that some people say that it is a more on the dull side of the color, but far as this one it's very it's very black and very white so and it's a perfect vibe for me and Michael um especially with that little light underneath it it kind of makes like when you have it on the blue light because it changes colors I don't know if I showed you enough on that one but um it makes the ocean look blue <laughs> and then you see the stars or the lots of blue and it just and it sounds like water um it's just really nice to look at when you're on the bed so, um i really like it really happy with this purchase too and maybe one day i will use it as a backdrop for my actual filming setup but right now i'm just enjoying what i have um but yeah who knows next month you might see this as a backdrop but here is the last thing that I purchased from Amazon is this mirror and I I would say this if anything ooh, I would say try something else before purchasing this would be this one not to say it's not a great mirror because I'm totally gonna be using it every day until Maybe I'll get another one for like a birthday or Christmas or something. So it's like, it's good, especially with the price because I think I paid only like 10 bucks. Um, like I said, I'll have that link down below. Um, but yeah, so the, I'll go over the problem first, is the light. Oh, did it give out on me? Okay, so it just ran out of batteries. And like I said, I only, um... Have had this for maybe over two weeks. Um, I could tell it was already dim, dimming, 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 whatever, dimming. Yes, um, for like a week now, but I just ran it dry. 
Um, I will say I wish it was like an automatic timer. If you don't use it, it would cut itself off because it, I can't remember to turn on and off lights for anything. Mostly off lights. As you can tell above me, my fan's on. Um, that's the only complaint I have about it is the battery situation. Um, but most of the time when I'm wearing makeup, I'm in front of an open window anyway, so it's not that big of a deal, I guess. But, you know, like when you're waking up really early, um, in the mornings and you're doing your makeup, you need a light. So that will be a problem for me next time I need a light. Um, so I need to change the batteries. I think I read that it has a USB like plug-in spot, but I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But right now I have like, I think it's two AA batteries. I'm not exactly sure. You can read the description thing on it um, when I link it, but it is a very nice mirror. As you can tell, I have like my nail glue and maybe an eyeliner or something um in that one and you know there's another holder right there and then there's a little place where you can put stuff right there so i like that and i do like um let's see this is the magnifying part on it hey um i do like that i barely use that part but there's the regular mirror and then you got the mirror on the side. You got the mirror on the side. So you'll see everything. Alright, that is my last item. So I'll come back at you with the outro. Alright, I hope you enjoyed my Amazon finds. And my mini reviews of each product. If you check it out any of these or you're interested in one of these. Or if you have something to recommend me from Amazon. Link it in the... Or comment in the comment box because I want to read. I'm watching these. If you have a channel and you do, you're on Amazon haul. Link it down below because I love Amazon hauls right now. So yeah. Um, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and I will see you buddies all next time. Bye!